acupuncture is an ancient healing art that was started about 3,000 years ago in China, and it's based on what's called meridian therapy. So if you take a look at this model, you can see on the model there's a bunch of lines on this guy from head to toe, front to back. Okay? And when you see, uh, basically those, uh, path, those lines are pathways of energy, which is called your chi, or your internal energy. So when you see an acupuncturist put needles on different parts of the body, what they're trying to do is manipulate that energy, make the body stronger so that it can heal itself. Now, probably the biggest question that I get about acupuncture is, do the needles hurt? Okay, And the answer to that is typically not. And the reason for that is, number one, is the needles are very, very small. Most people, when they think of needles, they think of a hypodermic needle when they go to a medical doctor's office. Okay, Well, these needles are about one-tenth that size. So if you can zoom in here, you can take a look and see. I don't know if you can get a uh, good picture of that or a clear picture of that, but you can see they're very, very, very small. Okay. So, and the other reason why um, it doesn't hurt is that these, uh, the tips on the needles are finely polished um, at the factory, and so that also cuts down on the sensation. Okay. So if you take a look here at my patient, you can see, you want to get a little closer, you can see that uh, this is what they look like when the needles are placed in the body. And I'm actually going to go ahead, while you're zoomed in there, I'm going to go ahead and place the needle in so you can see what that looks like. Okay, So there's the needle going in. And as you can see, uh, that's not hurting the patient. It goes in nice and easy, and that's what that looks like. Now. I get a lot of questions about what conditions can be helped with acupuncture. So a lot of people say, well, can acupuncture help this, can it help that? A lot of different questions. And really the easy answer to that is that pretty much any condition that you can think of can be helped at least in part with acupuncture because again, what we're trying to do is make the body stronger so that it can heal itself. So um, all in all, there's about uh, 2,000 conditions at least that can be helped with acupuncture. Uh, some of the more common conditions that I see in the office here include things like low back pain, headaches, muscle spasm, uh, shoulder pain, uh, digestive or bowel issues, uh, depression, um, even people trying to quit smoking. Now, one thing that you can do at home to help yourself with acupuncture uh, is actually to use what's called acupressure because it doesn't, it doesn't require any needles. So for example, there's a point called large intestine 4 which is in the web of the hand. Um, a lot of times people with headaches can benefit from uh, stimulating this point. So what you do is just use moderate pressure in the web of the hand for about three, anywhere from 3 to 30 seconds on both sides and for a lot of people that does help with their headaches. Now <clears throat> with this information, uh, if you have any questions on what I talked about today, um, any comments, please leave it in the comment box below. If you know anyone that can benefit from this information, uh, please tag them or simply like or share the video. Any other questions, uh, feel free to call us at 635-9655 or visit us at healthquestgroup.com. Again, my name is Dr. Tang. I thank you for watching today and we'll see you next week.